customer wants to install an outlet in their garage to charge their Tesla from home. I'm gonna install a NEMA 1450 50 amp outlet flush mount in their garage. I'm gonna run my 6.3 Romex from the outlet up to the attic in the garage, but I no longer have attic anymore after that point. So then I need to run from where the water heater vent goes up to the attic of the second story. After getting my wire to the attic in the second story, I'll run it down to my panel outside and install a new breaker. I have an existing flex in the panel going up to the attic. This wire is for a gable fan in the attic. I'm gonna tie my new Tesla circuit to this existing wire and pull it up to the J box in the attic along with the gable fan circuit. Now that I have my wires ran to the J box in the attic, I'm gonna run Romex all the way down to the soffit area where the water heater goes down to the garage. I cut a small hole in the garage, sent my snake up from the garage to the attic, tied my wire, and now I'm gonna pull my wire up to my j box in the attic. I sleeved my Romex with flex where it's exposed in the garage. Now I have it in the attic above the garage. I'm gonna bring it to my new location where the outlet's going. I cut out my box and I have a fire block above the box where I have to run my wire, so I gotta drill it. And then I'm gonna send my snake up through the hole that I just drilled and tie my wire from the attic and pull it back down. I tied my wire in the attic and now I'm pulling it back. I got my box installed and my outlet wired. I got the new outlet installed. I got the new 50 amp breaker wired, breaker on, and that's your end result.